Okay, guys, let's get started. We're going to fold the towel a third of the way, making sure that the sides are nice and neat. Start rolling it up, making sure that everything is secure. Just tuck it in as you go if it begins to come uneven. So continue rolling, rolling, rolling until you're all done. And just sit that over to the side. And let's start making the outside towel. So with this one, we're going to fold it a third of the way as well. But instead of rolling it, we're going to simply fold it in half. Okay, let's start installing it on the rail. You're gonna need a hair tie. I had this other little piece of decor that I wanted to try just to see how it looked. It, well, you're gonna open it up, place it over the rack, making sure that everything is neat. Go ahead and get your hair tie and we're going to wrap it around about two times. That should be good enough for it to be tight enough to securely hang. Okay, once you've put that on, go ahead and grab your towel that we rolled up nice and neat and place it inside of the towel. It should not hang out on the sides because we folded both towels a third of the way. So they should fit evenly within. Okay, once you've gotten the towel in, go ahead and adjust your towel to begin making your flower. Just start, you know, playing with the outsides of the towels, making them form until like a flower. It's pretty simple. To worry about the hair tie showing because you can adjust it to where you won't be able to see it. But I noticed that I left the tag on the towel, so I'm just going to get the scissors and cut that piece off and continue making the flower. Let's start with the second one. The second one didn't really go that well um, due to the decor piece that I tried to put a little bling on there, but it wasn't working out for me. So I just decided to, you know, use another hair tie because that one was not lining up with the other one. So here's how it turned out, you guys. I love it. It was easy, simple. Only thing you needed was four towels. Um, two hair ties and you just simply manipulate it how you want it to look in the end so this is very simple let me know if you all enjoyed this and if you plan to decor your tiles this way <laughs>